So at the moment it's Friday the 13th. And many people are like, oh no, what's going to happen? Bad things are going to happen today. And I personally don't believe in any of that crap. I don't see myself as a person who believes in superstitions, like cracking a mirror and having bad luck, or anything like that. But, when it does just come averagely to the number 13, I do get a bit curious. I don't do it purposely, and I don't think I do believe, if people ask me, in unlucky numbers or things that can bring bad luck just from thinking something or doing something. But while being unaware, I do do certain things I've realised over the last couple of days that avoid the number 13. For instance, when I'm going to bed, I don't turn my alarm clock on the volume 13 sometimes. I'll go 14 or 12. I don't know why. Nothing bad's going to happen. I know it's not going to happen, but still, for some reason, I do it. If I was to play a game and I got chosen the number 13, I sometimes doubt and I think, oh, that's quite unlucky. I don't know why, because... Again, I know there's nothing unlucky, it's just unlike any other number. It's like being chosen number 8 or number 6. But for some reason I still think it's number 13. Now for me the number, or the unlucky number 13, is a tiny bit like OCD. Now I don't know if any of you guys have it, but it's to me where you're doing things that you're actually unaware you're taking in consideration. So sometimes I might be, I don't know, picking something up. And for some reason I feel the urge to touch it with the other hand afterwards. I don't know why. I don't get it anymore. I used to have the, I used to have a thing where if I spun to them one way, I had to spin back the other way just to feel it even. And the number 13 to me is a tiny bit like that. I don't know why I avoid it. I don't avoid it necessarily. Like, I don't mind it that much. But to little things about the choice, I won't choose it. Now I don't know if any of you guys have any weird little things like the number 13 or OCDs or really scared of breaking a mirror, or you don't walk under a ladder, that's another one. Little things like that. Now, I don't really walk under a ladder if I have the choice, but I don't know why. I know nothing bad's going to happen, I just don't do it just in case. So if you guys could comment below now any little things that you're curious of or something like that, um, it'd be really cool. Thanks for watching, guys.